Predict the decision, love me or hate me, there's no in between. So we already got a problem. Fair use Guardian News. Why is Kelly Rowland, her sexy dark chocolate ass, wearing some motherfucking SpongeBob square pants suit and Beyonce has on a nice little black dress ensemble? This is crazy, bro. They still, and I can't believe Kelly Rowland is still going through this to this day. You going through this to this day, Kelly Rowland? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you even... So what if this shit was in Texas? You didn't have to dress like that. You're a feminine, beautiful, black, dark chocolate woman. Why would you wear this fucking SpongeBob SquarePants suit? Like, this is crazy. I This is crazy. Look at this shit. We already know half the people left the goddamn rally anyway when they found that it wasn't a Beyonce concert or whatever. But this is crazy. Look at what she's wearing. How they disrespect you like this, Kelly Girl, and to this day, 20 years later, they still disrespect you. When you came out with Motivation with Lil Wayne, you topped the charts with that fucking record. You didn't have no Michelle, no, no Latavia, no Beyonce backing you. It was just the South fucking with Texas and Louisiana. Took Tunchi and Kelly Rowland. Y'all killed that record, Motivation. That record would put ch chocolate girls on a map. Even Kevin Simmons says to this day, you Kelly, he said you Rihanna, he said you Beyonce, you eight. He said you Kelly Rowling, you nine, and Rihanna's a ten. He said those are the top tier girls, and this and you was a nine, b. Look, and you wearing a fucking SpongeBob SquarePants suit. What the fuck is going on, man? Look at this shit. <laughs> I'm not here as a politician. I'm here as a mother. Yes, deeply about the world my children and all of our children live in. A world where we have the freedom to control our bodies. My body, my choice, because I want to be a hoe. Our past, Look at Kelly Rowland, B. That's our ridiculous. Present, our future merge to meet us here. Wait a minute. If you're going to control your bodies, y'all should at least let Kelly Rowland control what she fucking wears. Because she wasn't trying to wear that shit. This shit is crazy. Oh. What they do to her. A song that began 248 years ago. The old notes of downfall, discord, despair no longer resonate. Our generations of loved ones before us are whispering a prophecy. A quest, a calling, an anthem. Our moment right now, it's time for America to sing a new song. Our voices sing a chorus of unity. They sing a song of dignity and opportunity. Are y'all ready to add your voice to the new American song? Because I am. So let's do this, ladies and gentlemen. Please give a big, loud Texas welcome to the next president of the United States, Vice President Kelly. What they did to Kelly? Got her wearing that fucking, look at that shit, bro. Yo, how can you do that to Kelly Rowland, bro? Kelly Rowland is the most beautiful dark chocolate motherfucker I've ever seen on walking on this fucking planet Earth, man. And y'all let her come out with this SpongeBob SquarePants suit and Beyonce's in a black ensemble suit. Like, come on, bro. What, Kelly, how, if y'all control, this is what I'm saying. If y'all voting to control the anatomy of your, uh, the autonomy of y'all fucking bodies. My body, my choice. Uh, uh, uh. You know how many unwanted fathers was made? Because it was my body, my choice, fucking goddamn rhetoric that, that pushed niggas away and shit like that. Yeah, it takes two to tango, but a lot of niggas I pull out week out, uh, pull out games is weak, nigga. It is what it is, but that's a whole other video. But the factor is, I understand Beyonce, they went to Texas, Kelly Rowland was there. Why are you wearing that, Kelly? Kelly, this is how I know y'all not focus on your autonomy. Of your bodies. Because someone told you to put that shit on. Like it was cute. That's not a cute outfit for a slim chocolate girl. 
that's feminine, and we like to see her body and her curvaceous, um, slim figure. Like, what the fuck? Slim and curvaceous, yes. She's very curvaceous, uh, curvaceous and slim. Y'all niggas ain't really see Kelly Rowland with them abs and, and ooh, she looking good. Even when she had the Dilemma record with Nelly, she was looking good, B. I ain't like the record too much, because it's Dilemma. Oh, this world will get close to you. Nah, you know, Nelly did this thing, the Dirty NT, we all we got. You know what I mean? I, I remember the days. But it is what it is, though. But, Kelly, what were you wearing, bro? A pinstripes zoot suit? Wasn't it the zoot suits? Even the Mexican girls and the uh, um the, the, the Spanish girls, Latinas, look good with the zoot suits on. The zoot suits even was fitted for them to look curvaceous and appealing. You just look like a SpongeBob SquarePants with them high-ass shoulder pads. You look crazy, Kelly. Kelly, stand for yourself, B. This is a damn shame what they did to Kelly Rowland on this bullshit. And Beyonce, you should be full of shit yourself, too. Because friends don't let friends come out on campaign trails looking like that, B. That's a fact, man. Petition decision. Hate me and love me this no between. Ten more days to the election. Back in 2024, we here. Because even Trump wouldn't even let her walk out like that. That's crazy how she was walking around here looking like that. Man, it is what it is. Get, get the like, comment, subscribe. Help me out with this.